All right, let's take a look at what I have done real quick, progress-wise. You saw in the videos, uh, getting the interior painted. I started out with black, then I moved on to German gray. So I need to do some more painting in it. I need to finish. I need to get the package self painted in, uh, get it painted in German gray and some touch-up. Then I need to finish getting the uh, front seats painted. I didn't do an overly good job, so I need to touch up some more of that. Uh, the engine getting there. It's getting close. I uh, just have some more parts to add to it and it'll be good. And a decal. Rear suspension. Uh, the brakes. As you saw, I painted them uh, with uh, aluminium. So now I'm going to go over them. Or now I'm going to do the brake rotors. I think I'm going to do them in red. I think that's what they are on the one that I'm, the car that I'm doing a semi-replica of. I think they're red on the real one. It's hard to see in those photographs. I'm just going to do them red, and then I'll come back and I'll do the center section of the brake rotors, and they will be done. And the rest of the bits there, just random bits. Uh, the intercooler there, I tried doing it, the, I tried the dull coat trick on it. I masked off the sides of the uh, the intercooler and did the middle, shot the middle with dull coat, but it didn't dull it down enough. So I think I'm gonna do. I'm gonna mask it off one more time and then hit the middle with aluminum, aluminum, and that should be good for that. The uh, exhaust pipe, as you saw, painting it. Uh, started off with uh, steel. Came back with a little bit of burnt metal up here and in the muffler in aluminium. So that is the, uh, the exhaust pipe. Good enough for government work, if this was government work. So that is kind of what I've done so far. Now let's get some progress made. Alright, let's get something done here. Real quick, before I move on with the engine, I am going to paint the oil filter. Uh, I'm going to paint it black as uh, Nismo oil filters are black. I figured this is a Nismo custom, it'd probably have a Nismo oil filter. Seen to me as lacquer bottle paint, jar paint, whatever you want to call it. All right, it's close enough. It's not going to be seen realistically, anyway, really. Realistically speaking, it's not going to be seen once it's everything is done and then we'll get uh, the in intake decal on real quick.
All right, let that sit for a bit. And uh, we need to get the uh, the exhaust manifold and turbos in place. So let's do that real quick while that is drying up there. Let's see how it works. Let that dry for a moment. All right, I think it's dry now. I can attach the um, Maybe we'll get it attached one day. All right. There we go. That is attached. Are the turbo and intake attached to the engine? All right, I think the engine is good. Put on the side looks good. I'll put that to the side. Mask off the intake for to do a little bit of aluminum painting there in the middle. Like I said in that video, it always using dull coat over chrome doesn't always work. Again, it just depends. In this case, it probably should start getting the body ready for primer. So a couple of things left to do on the body. I mean, one we need to attach these little attach the side skirts, and then we need to open up the front bumper. You can see that to attach the uh, intake vents. Or the vents, whatever they're called. Uh, we need to do that too. Right, so let's attach the uh, side skirts, shall we? Side. Side skirts are attached. Both sides. All right. 